Spard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. Jennifer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Time we were on our way. Mm-hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt. We should stay out of it. Just this once. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down? To hang a golden sun there now? I cannot show Temerian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fund a period. You fund God's whore. I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out of the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you? A ver, vamos a poner el micro. Let's go. And you don't fear the gods' wrath. You don't fear it. You can't. Se empieza a tensar el ambiente. Recognize this medallion. You know what it means. Back off. You all right? That's true. What the emperor promised you, freaks? Your own land, like he did the elves once. Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. And neither are you. They won't back down now. Ha cortado el brazo. A ver si alguien se apunta. 
much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. That brawl, we didn't start it. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience <coughs> has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? He didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. Por qué Vizima? We can talk here. Some charming orchards nearby. In bloom even, so you almost can't smell the corpses. A tempting proposition. Sadly, I must say no. You see, someone awaits you in Vizima. Someone who doesn't like to be kept out. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or to those on more intimate terms with him. The white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. I number among that group. Or as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse. <clears throat> I didn't. Though I could have. Well. Supongo que no pasa nada por escuchar. Fine. Guess I'm willing to hear him out. The Emperor of Nilfgaard, Lord of Metina, Ebbing and Gamera, Sovereign of Nazare and Vicovaro will feel honored, I'm sure. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaermor, remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. Sí que tiene prisa por volver al castillo. Y el otro se va a caer moen. La fortaleza de los brujos. You know, I had a dream about you recently. Knowing you, it was probably filthy. Just the beginning. But then. But then. Son los que llaman la cacería. Son los del sueño de Geralt. Al principio de, del juego.
sorcerer's Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now she's just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. Ahí ve el limpito. Must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the bergère. The what now? In that chair. Catherine, we shave the gentleman sideburns to half an inch. Parece que nos van a quitar las barbas. What's wrong with my beard? I always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine. Do your thing. Tilt your head back, please, and sit still. And prepare to answer some questions. General, I, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their heart. Movran Vuris. Commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality, but one that must be seen to. Sure. Paperwork's gotta be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia. Place of birth unknown. Parents unknown. Age unknown. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate <coughs> of the defending commander one Ami. Vale, esto es para ver lo que hiciste en el The Witcher 2. Así que yo voy a poner pues, lo que vaya surgiendo. Le perdonaré la vida y escapo. Arian escaped, set fire to the castle on his way out. So that is how the blade started. Our reports suggested the dragon was responsible. Moving on. You then found shelter in charming flots, and from there made your way to Verg. My question is how. <coughs> ese es el comandante de los franjas azules venga voy a poner que me uní a Iorbeth que me parece que es un elfo sí. The infamous summit at Loch Moon. You were there. And once again meddled in the affairs of the mighty. Tenía que salvar a Triss Marigold. The mighty had imprisoned Triss Marigold. I don't know I care about her. And I tend to rescue those I care about. And so you did, handing Radovid control of the Conclave and Council of Mages in the process. Nilfgaard recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. The gentleman must sit still. 
I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila to dust. Eso es bueno que sea las escapas. What's Leather up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah, so Leather was hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc. Here, um, here. With these formalities seen to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Count. Good luck. <coughs> Feels more like I'm being ready for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Where are my clothes? Where they should have gone long ago, with the laundress. They will be returned to you after the audience, clean and starched. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. Well, vamos a ver qué hay por aquí primero. Vamos a sacar aquí todas las cosillas. Una espada. Las brujas. Vamos a leer esto. Uf. Hay mucho rollo por aquí. Déjame que. A ver. Sudor de la sangre. Ah, mira. Una entrada en un bestiario. Eso está bien. Otro libro más. Venga. Parece que ya está todo listo. Pues yo creo que nos vamos a poner este de aquí. Tal vez los vamos a coger todos y luego los vendamos. Venga, vamos a ver con el pomo. Son todos un poco ruina. Pero bueno. Las botas son las mismas. Bueno, 
parece que ya está. Yo creo que este es el mejor. Vamos allá. And they say clothes do not make a man. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? Pues la verdad no sé cómo funciona muy bien eso, Ville, lo del lo del moderador. No tengo ni idea. Habría que mirarlo. Cuando tenga bastante más gente en el chat. Pues lo miraré para ver cómo lo modera. De todas maneras hay una configuración de un moderador automático que te dice que intenta que no salgan ciertas palabras y cosas. No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Confirm away. Please watch. Leg extended. Hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Si la veis. Pierna. Mano izquierda, pierna derecha. Vamos a probar con esta. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Once more. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. Izquierda adelante, la derecha al pecho. Venga. Izquierda adelante, la derecha al pecho. Ahí está ahí. Hmm, lacking fluidity and grace, but we've learned to expect less of Northlings. Come with me. Vamos. The gentleman will address the emperor only when asked to, and using the appropriate title. Your arch magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests. I fear the emperor might not share his disposition. Your majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Bueno, vamos a ver qué nos cuenta el emperador de los Nilfgaardianos. <coughs> Dyfen Aden in Khan et Narvut, Emir Var Emreis. Bow. Ah, reverencias. Your Imperial Majesty. Arer et do orde. Pavilion Namim, Bat Gun Favor. So many months of Voltaire's court, yet you still haven't mastered the basics of etiquette. You know what they say? Can't teach an old wolf new tricks. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. <coughs> you will find her and bring her to me. Bueno, a ver. Aquí, por lo menos en este juego, vale, no me sé la historia completa de The Witcher, vale. Pero Cirilla, por lo visto, es la hija real o, digamos, de, de sangre del emperador, vale. Y Cirila es la que sale de la serie, que es Ciri. Vale. Y es una chica que me parece que se ha escapado y no sabemos dónde está. 
Vamos a dar a ver si ha vuelto. You believe I drag you here in the middle of a war to discuss a rumor? I think anyone can be wrong, even an emperor. I had forgotten how insolent he could be. I haven't the time to convince you, nor the desire, in fact. Yanafu will do that after the audience. Bueno, saber por qué me quiere a mí para buscar a Ciri. How many men in your army? Twenty thousand? Thirty? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you are looking for her. I doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Hmm. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. Necesito información. No motivación. Voy a poner que solo hago esto por fe. Save your generosity for those whose homes your armies have raised. I'll do it for Siri, not for your gold. Your motives do not interest me. Only results. Yanafu will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. Did the champion not understand? Yes. Did I not emphasize adequately that one must bow to the emperor? Relax, nothing happened. To the gentleman. But I shall be punished. How? Please keep close and bother no one. Yeah, the knowledge is of etiquette for one day. And it's past noon. Calm yourself. What? what? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? I'm Herobard the Second, Prince of Elaine. Not only am I made to wait here like some kind of supplement. Rad sleep ne enekt. Ted attake in and kalant ne se voloi sa. Eptusa. Mind if I interrupt? Why not join in instead? We're discussing neutrality. How difficult it is to preserve. Simple method of trying. Try. Because? Because there are few causes worth serving, even fewer men. Enough about that. Mind if we change the subject? the Emperor. Hmm. Why did he summon you? So not even you know. No. But I wager it's an ordinary witch's contract. Mm -hmm. Some weird bubs. Hmm. See ya. Soon, mind you. Request will hard the lady. I said in bueno, sigamos. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Yes? Then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchant's guild, but the church of the eternal fire. That tunic will look positively smashing. Dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now, do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm -hmm. 
and seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. Let's focus on Siri, all right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Siri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me. Guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt, before the wild hunt does. <clears throat> I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. I know as much as you do. It must be about her blood. Her gift. As for what the hunt wishes to do with that gift, I... I prefer not to think about it, really. So where has Siri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novograd. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. You should get in touch with him. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors, but there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Siri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. <laughs> One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I didn't want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. <laughs> I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? Let's drop it, all right? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish to hear it. Any of it. Bueno, en resumidas cuentas, eh, hemos ido a hablar con el, con el emperador. Y, y le ha dicho que tiene que buscar a Ciri, Cirila, ¿vale? Que es la que sale, la chica que sale en la serie, que es la hija del emperador, ¿vale? Entonces, Cirila es la que estaba entrenando al principio del juego con, con Geralt. Y eh, ya está, pues nos hemos decidido que vamos a ayudar al emperador y a, y a esta chica a, a buscar a Ciri, ¿vale? Así que ya está. Simplemente eso. Tenemos que ir a Novigrado, que es una ciudad que hay al norte, y esta chica se va a ir a 
Skellige, que son las islas que hay al oeste, me parece. Bueno, vamos a ver. Nada, se va a llevar todos los libros. Yo no puedo usar la magia. A ver. Una carta a Jennifer. Vamos a leerla. Esta carta de Frenchila. <risa> bueno, en fin, vamos a ver por aquí las cosillas que hay: libros, cosas, más libros. salir aquí hay un cofre bueno, menos mal algo más, más mejor diagrama de arpía y página de manuscrito de hacer de aceite para bestias Bien, vamos consiguiendo más cosillas Jennifer suggested I ask you about current events, the war and so on. Of course. The Emperor's servants should keep no secrets from each other. If you will, let us approach the map. A ver, vamos a preguntar que cómo va la guerra. I assume this to be a private conversation. We've no witnesses, so let's dispense with the propaganda, even that shrouded in irony. Our offensive was going splendidly until winter came. Edern was in such disarray that we encountered no resistance. We had reached the Pontar before the first snows. Only a weakened Kedwin remained, and Radovid's Redania, which had ignored the rest of the North's pleas for help. We thought they'd sue for peace. Perhaps even submit to vassalization. We waited for spring, certain of victory. Radovid, submit? Yes, in vain hope I agree. Radovid sent no peace envoy, nor did he advance on our positions. Instead, he trudged over the snow-bound Kestrel Mountains and attacked Kedwin, his ally. This attack took the Kedweni by surprise. They were still mourning the loss of their king. Rudderless and dejected, they laid down their arms after a few lost skirmishes. 
and joined Radovid. And so by spring, <clears throat> instead of two weak enemies, we had only one powerful one. That admiration I hear in your voice. Radovid is our foe, but I cannot deny he is clever. He played us for fools, particularly dense ones at that. Returning to the war, this spring there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive, yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses. Unprecedented. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now. Until reinforcements arrive from the south. Then Emperor Amir Bar Enris will deal with you once and for all. Couldn't you just go home? Save everyone a lot of marching, not to mention a few human lives. I'm afraid the stakes are too high to fold now. We can only go all in. Bueno. Ya está. No quiero más noticias de la guerra. Thanks for your help. Think nothing of it. May the great sun light your path. Vamos hasta aquí. How might I serve the gentleman? By returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, Bunches. The Emperor is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound. As soon as possible. Yeah. Mention something of the sort. So long. Emperor shall guide us straight to Novigrad. Bueno. Hemos cumplido la misión. Vamos a ver por aquí. Me parece que había alguien con una carta. Estoy creado. A ver. Mm. Vamos a jugar al Wind. Vamos a apostarlo todo. Mind a few rounds of cards. Todo no. Diez monedillas. Uh, Escuchen, no. A ver. Ajá. Venga, los reinos del norte. No tengo ninguna cosilla mía así más por aquí. No. Vamos a quitarnos esto. No quiero tanto. Tiempo despejado, no los quiero. Porque tenemos una habilidad especial. Bueno, ya. Ya lo haremos. Creo que hablé el otro día en el vídeo del Wind. ¿vale? Otros, mirad como juego y si gano, pues podéis aprender. Si no, pues también. A ver, aquí todas las cartas, las primeras cartas que hay, y es para elegir cuál descartamos. Yo creo que esta la vamos a poner porque esto añade más uno a las filas de la misma fila. Entonces tenemos estas que nos va a añadir más uno a los trabuguetes. Es, no sé, me voy a quitar alguna de estas. Oh, esto es una ruina. Nada, la he liado. Pero bueno, ya está. <coughs> mm. 
De ahí cuando sales y vas al mundo. No, no te entiendo, Billy. Venga, vamos igualados. No, mira, un espía. Pues este espía nos lo vamos a quedar porque se lo vamos a poner luego a él. El espía lo que hace es que me da más cartas. De hecho, se lo vamos a poner ya. Ahí va. Pues habrá que ponerle cositas. Vamos a ver si quiere pasar la ronda y perder. Sí, parece que quiere perder la ronda. Pues ahora. Ahora vamos a ir con todo. Vamos a ver. Descartes, vamos a coger a este de aquí. Bien, bien. Vaya, me parece que vamos a saltar la ronda. Sí, vamos a saltar la ronda, me parece. Ahí. Ahora he perdido yo, pero ahora tengo ventaja. Tengo más cartas que él. Esta carta es potente. Vamos a ver. Ahora él tiene la carta más. complica ella la cosa ah mira si he hecho esa carta es que no tiene mucha cosa más Le queda una carta. Oh, oh, me va a ganar el cabrón. Ah, pues no. He ganado, pero por los pelos. 
Y... Ah, me ha dado la carta de Foltest. Sí. Bueno, hemos ganado una cartita. Pues se supone que ahora mismo voy a matar monstruos, Guille. Lo que pasa. A ver. Mapa del mundo. Belén, que es donde estábamos antes. Entonces tenemos que ir aquí. Otro día te lo enseño además. Me parece que hay una aplicación por ahí para jugar a, la, a las cartas de Witch para el móvil. Así que en navidades y eso te lo enseño. Vale, esto es una expansión Vale, esto de la expansión también Perritos. Hola. A por culo los perros. Nah, esto no da carne y cebo. Vaya, otra poción me toma. Bueno, vamos a coger aquí las mesioncillas que haya. A ver si hay alguna. Y vamos a ver en el mapa a ver dónde tenemos que ir. Vale. Tenemos que ir a, a Novigrado, que me parece que es esto de ahí. ¿Y esto qué es? Misiones. 
sé, eh, me hicieron demasiado difíciles tras los pasos de Ciri. Tenemos que buscarla en Belen, en Skellig y en Novigrado. La conexión Nilfgaardiana. Vale, yo creo que podríamos hacer esta misión. Lo que pasa es que es un poquito tarde, me parece a mí que vamos a llegar hasta allí y lo vamos a dejar. Bueno, eso lo dejaremos para el próximo día. A ver. A ver, la espadita de plata. Un demonio podrido. Coño. Hostia, hostia. Explota, mierda. Sangre de demonio podrido. Cosa más rara, ¿eh? ¿Y qué había por aquí? Ah, más perros. No, al final me matarán. A ver. ¿Moriré o no moriré? Hola. Parece que no he muerto. Ah, 
join a group of refugees, fucking bursting with patriotism they were. As soon as they learned I'd abandoned Tamaria in her hour of need, they beat me down, tied me up like a turkey, left me to the drowners. Man. Fine, no help. Oh, thanks. For a minute there, I was almost sure you'd leave me to die. I'd like to thank you somehow, but I'm not a chip crown to me name. Tough. I'll take the loss. Thanks, Witcher. May you prosper on the path. Bueno, los cadáveres de los sumergidos ya los he saqueado. Venga. estos oh. está dañada vale la espada de plata de brujo y no tenemos más espadas de plata no eh, tenemos aquí kit de reparación de armaduras pero no de armas Ya está. Ay, habrá que ganar con una arma rota. O quizás con un poquito de magia. Ay. Bonito. <coughs> Strangers coming, run for your lives. Una posada. Bueno, lo vamos a dejar aquí por hoy. Y el próximo día venimos y hacemos lo que haya que hacer. Vamos a ver, vamos a guardar por aquí mismo. Listo. Pues nada. Hemos terminado y, y ya está. El próximo día, pues más cosillas. ¿eh? Así que listo. Nos veremos. Vale, Guille. Cuídate.